All right, and we're back. You ready to be a Disney princess? Always ready to be a Disney princess. Nice. We're gonna kill it. We're gonna paint the shit out. We're gonna paint this world red. We're gonna paint the roses red. And the world red. And violets red. And the house is red. And the grass red. Everything red with the blood of our enemies. (laughs) Have you seen that one? (laughs) Roses are gray. Violets are gray. Everything is fucking gray. I'm a fucking dog. Yes, I love that one. (laughs) Roses are gray. Violets are gray. Everything is gray. I'm a fucking dog. Yes. I'm a fucking dog, wolf. My favorite is roses are red, violets are red, there's blood everywhere, and it's all yours. (laughs) I love it. Strange creatures are taking hold of the colors from the rainbow. Oh no. Not the rainbow. Oh no. Dude, that's my song. Also, I don't know how you do that because it's a fraction of light, which means it would remove the colors from all things. But, you know, whatever. My friends have gone to the top of this hill. You'll see them by the rainbow. Don't worry, Snow White. I'll go see them. This is just like... Your person was just... like de- No, like, Death Mute was just, like, staring off into space while you were t- she was being told instructions. Like, I don't even fucking care. <laughs> Alright. Thanks, Snow White. Let's go paint a rainbow, I guess. Paint the rainbow red with the color of our enemy. <sighs> How unfortunate. Shinit. <laughs> Shinit. Damn it, Derek. Ah, got him. There we go. Hey, you, dwarf man, tell me what's up. Oh, that's him. Tell me what's up. Tell me what's up. Okay. He's taking a sweet time to tell me what's up. Oh, my. Well, we sure are glad to see you, my dear. We need your help. So really? The I want to see you, so you know, you might help. I don't think so. Looks fine to me. Because you're probably cattle blind. The animation of that one, for some reason, <laughs> <laughs> reminded me of uh, the Spyro the speed Hallelujah. challenge oh. things when they glitch out and they were like, <laughs> Oh god, yeah. <laughs> But where do we start? Where don't we don't start? Oh, I'm sure cats are through. That's blue. That's blue. Will you help us do Why, of course. Friends always help each other. <laughs> Thank make you. sure you with friends. things look just fine. <laughs> all the colors of the rainbow. Oh no, actually, it's all the colors of the wind. Can you paint with all the colors of the wind? Which, by the way, the wind doesn't have many colors, so I don't, I don't understand. So we have to go back to the mine, which is somewhere. Right? Uh, I this is not sure. Let's go that way. I won't argue with you, because I have no idea. No. Definitely not this way. Because there is one hell of an invisible wall here. Let's hurry to the mine. I'm trying. I'm getting there. God. Do 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 do. Oh no. Oh, that's where we were. Okay. So can you fucking move for once? Oh no. That's a powerful ass looking red man. They're performing a cult! That's nothing new. Check. Wrong button. Whoa! We actually started losing health there. Did you see that? 
That never happens. Gosh, and it's already back. Red bag. It's fine. <laughs> Look, and the princess sent me to tell you there's some swag. Blue magic in the forest. And maybe that's blue magic in the forest. The color blue. You can count the color on blue. blue. We gotta go to the forest so we can find the color blue. blue. Wait, I want this treasure chest. Right. For all the gems that we can't collect. Now it. <laughs> Perfect. Well done. Alright, so now we gotta go to the forest. Do you know where the forest is? Yes. Do you know how to paint with all the colors of the wind? Yes. Wind doesn't have colors. I'm, I, I can, I'll never get over this. That mountain range in the background. And by that, I mean one singular mountain. No, 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 they're like, it's like hoarding mobs in like an MMO. Like you just get them all to follow you, and then you kill them all with like an AOE attack, and you're like, good enough. I thought it was you for a second. Ooh. Oh, oh no! He just took away all the colors of the rainbow. Oh, all no, the colors know. of the rainbow. You gotta come back down. I can't get up now. Okay. Problem solved. As a fellow Disney princess, I'm sure to explore the forest. Who's telling me that? Oh yeah, the fairy godmother. Fairy. Yeah. No, not fairy godmother. They're just a fairy. Okay, fair enough. I figured she was our fairy. Well, she said she was like a fairy godmother, so something like that. Something like that, right? She's actually the final boss. <laughs> She's actually your inner doubt. Mm -hmm. uh, it's a very deep it's game. Forest. Okay, so look for me. some really deep. I shouldn't have moved that. Uh, <laughs> so look for some real deep blue. I'm assuming it's more like this way, though. Oh no! <laughs> that was <a> intense. <laughs> do, 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 do. It's time to eat some slime! <laughs> Huh. Killed it. You found the color blue. Well, that's you're here. You know where it is. No, I don't. Don't be awesome. Why couldn't you will. collect it? You okay. I don't have the magic I wands, Chris. Way. Good point. Let's go get the wand. Where is the grove, though? Oh. You're so good at directions, man. Thanks. <laughs> Fucking color scheme is great. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Blue and uh, yellow, with a really awful green tealish color. Mm -hmm. Disney princesses. Disney princesses. Disney princesses. I want to go to Disneyland now and scream about how I'm a Disney princess. Everybody's a Disney princess. And that they need to help me out getting my crown. <laughs> To like one of the cast members that's an actual Disney princess, so that they they have to stay in character, but are just incredibly unsettled and not of sure what to do about it. Yes, and you need to get more people to do it. Yes, I tell you, I had a plan that was like. I wanted to take, like, my youngest cousin to, like, Storybook Land. Not to take her to Storybook Land, but as an excuse for me and a couple friends of mine from college to go to Storybook Land and not seem like weirdo adults hanging around this little kid theme park. Yes. But it ended up escalating to the point where it was just like, so we'll go there, but we'll wear all, like, heavy-duty suits and sunglasses and get the earpieces so it seems like we're high-level security. And just follow her around the whole time, and if anyone ever like comes up and approaches us, just be like, step away from the girl. <laughs> just never say any more than that. <laughs> I appreciate you. <laughs> Sunglasses, and just, black hat. Just too. treat it like it's no, like full like like uh, FBI level like gear. It's I just fucking. Always surround her like she's some political figure. <laughs> just like, I guess I'm not allowed to talk to this person. Step away from the girl, ma'am. Ma'am, step away from the girl. Like, every ride we'd like have to step on first, like go in to like check under all the seats and shit and just be like, it's clear. Fuck <laughs> it. No, have a wave. Have two people flanking her and two people in front of her. Absolutely. 
And then if you have even more people, you have other people following slightly behind her. Yeah. I'll throw it wrong uh, It's like... I just think that would be such a great idea. Just the level of concern people would have. Just like, what the fuck is happening? Yes. <laughs> like, nah, that would be great. The things you can do to make people make can make some people really confused <laughs> sometimes, and it's always fun. Right. That was the other time. That was the other thing is that we just stay stone faced the whole time, regardless of how much fun we're having. We just stay completely stone faced, no reaction. Dude, you're getting in our way. Oh the god, everything, is getting, yeah, everything way. is getting in my way. <laughs> Painting the trees blue, painting the trees red in the color of our enemies. <laughs> Paint with all the colors of the wind. You better paint the wind. Now all you gotta do is use your magic. Oh, I mean magic. Magic. Fixed. Hey, all you gotta do is your magic. Magic, and it should be fixed, fixed. Oh wow, I'm actually in the shot. I'm amazed. I think so. <laughs> I mean, silent deaf mute. <laughs> Silence, slave mute. Grumpy's just like, I hate you all. <laughs> they don't even have all the dwarves. I <laughs> know. They only got four of them. <laughs> well, it would have cost more model to model the other, like, three. True. And Lazy's probably sleeping. Yeah, Lazy would be sleeping, you know. I don't even remember the other ones are. Dude, I don't remember any of them. When you said Doc, I was amazed you remembered Doc, because I don't even remember Doc most of the time. It's funny, because Doc's the only one who's not in emotion. Yeah, right. I just remember Dopey, Sleepy, and like Angry. Those are like the only three I ever. Oh, he's remember. grumpy. Oh, I guess and, and happy because he's a he's a, he's the happy emotion. That's it. Lazy. There's one that's lazy. Yeah, that's Sleepy. I don't know. I don't know any of their actual names. I just know the emotions mm -hmm. and then like what category of emotion they fell under. Yes. <laughs> oh, think one chapter. <laughs> the other one. <laughs> the emotion of death. The emotion of my feelings. <laughs> It's good. Oh no! Shining pendulum of God! We did. Oh god. Died a little we there. Who did it? <laughs> yeah, I did. Why not it starts us up here after we've beaten the world? Every time? It really throws me off. Every time. Alright, all that's left is Jeezman. I mean Aladdin. Your favorite princess. My Aladdin. favorite present says Aladdin. Oh, this is easy. Yeah. So Aladdin's story is weird, cause like, it has almost nothing to do with the movie, except for like a handful of shots. Did you? Do you know? Oh wait. Yeah, no. yeah. Like the original Aladdin. So uh, essentially, Aladdin's a lazy piece of shit. Ah. Um, so lazy that it kills his father. Uh -huh. His father dies over the how lazy his son is. Uh, and then his uncle shows up, but it's not really his uncle, and tells him that he'll give him a job, and the job is to go get the magical lamp. Um, and he does, but then he refuses it to give it to his uncle, so his the uncle leaves him trapped in there, and then he, like, I saw it first, it's mine! <laughs> this is also how I talk to people, waving my hands, <laughs> side to side. To but, uh, yeah, so then he gets trapped in the cave for, like, three days, and he's just like, Welp, I'm dead. Oh, well. And he accidentally r rubs his magic lit wing ring, which also has a genie in it. It's not a lamp, it's a ring. <laughs> well, it is a lamp, but he gets a magic ring that also has a genie in it before he gets the lamp. And he uses that to escape the cave, and then his mother rubs the lamp, and actually releases that genie. Also, the genies don't have a limit on how many wishes they can give. They can give infinite wishes. This is all made up by Disney to have a number. Huh. Yeah. 
So then he eventually marries the princess by like kidnapping her and making her stay at her his house every time she's on a date with her actual boyfriend. It's not. Yeah. Uh, it's just a pile of dirt. And then eventually they get married, which she gets over getting kidnapped, I guess. Yeah. Uh, over and over again. And then they eventually get married, and he pretends to be rich by being a genie. And then the original guy tries to steal the lamp back, and instead he kills them. Aladdin kills him. So then his brother wants revenge, so he goes there to trick them, and he does by tricking the princess into wishing for a rock which is a, a rock egg, which is a spiritual giant bird creature that's oh, yes, apparently yes, 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 the master of genies, which I did not you, know until uh, I read this story. Um, but yeah, apparently genies have masters, which are these giant bird rock creatures, and he refuses to give them that. And then the genie's just like, also, uh, you guys are fucking assholes, and I hope you all die, and I'm gonna be leaving you guys without any magical help. So he does that. He's like, but before I leave, I'll let you know that the dude who's uh, in your house is actually trying to kill you. Uh, <laughs> he's actually trying to kill you, and he's the brother of the guy that you killed, and they were like, oh, okay. So then they killed him, and then they live happily ever after, still with that one genie ring, still. And that's the plot of Aladdin. It has almost nothing to do with this one. Aladdin! So yeah, unfortunately, Disney ha Aladdin's uh, true mythos is probably the least interesting of all of them because it's not weird or messed up like the other ones we've done. But yes, I am. Minus the whole like double murders and like three attempts at murders in it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so if you actually look back in Romeo and Juliet, there's some cool scenes in there. Yeah. But they're literally only one line in the story. Yeah. They fight. Yeah, right. <laughs> Sounds about right. But on stage, that's like a five minute um, sword fight. I can help. S Slave mute, stay the hell off camera. I'm helping Jasmine. <laughs> you stay the fuck over there. <laughs> Don't worry, I have my own assistant. And I'm pretty sure she doesn't talk. No good. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll find your friend Abu. Oh, Abu, not Abu, not the princess. Jasmine, not the princess Aladdin. <laughs> <laughs> All right, there's nothing over there. I was hoping there'd be like stuff. There's a cat. There is a cat. I want him to lay instead of so he's not climbing all over everything while we're recording. Abu! Zavumaru! Zavumaru! We gotta save Zavumaru! Buy, buy watermelon. Yes. <laughs> you weren't even close to that one. You gotta go on this way. I don't know if I'm trying to distract the cat. Burn. Stop being distracted by my cat. I'm trying to distract the cat. Well, stop being in distraction for the cat. I don't know. I don't know. I'm done with this. Here do I. Savumafu! We gotta get Savumafu. You watch that show, right? Absolutely. I, I don't know anyone who doesn't watch that show. I was talking to somebody show. that show, and they were like, What show? And I'm like, You don't You don't know that show? No, of course not. That yeah. lucky dive. Yes. A long time well, ago. yeah, I was like, It's been a number of years now. <laughs> But the crack, the Kratz brothers, the guy, the two guys that were in that show, mm -hmm. they um, they just made a new show. They're making a new show. It's a little animated skit. Oh, they haven't. Well, they have an animated TV show, but I think they're doing another live yeah, they're action. Doing another show. Thing. Um, but I think it's just that they're they're pretty good, man. They're they're, they're like entertaining you. and they're actually knowledgeable about animals all at the same time. It's very impressive. Do you remember the Crocodile Hunters? Crocodile Hunter. Yeah. His family is now starting a new show. His daughter had a show right after he died, and all I can think of is, wow, that's kind of messed up, but whatever. <laughs> but they did, they're doing a new show where it's the family, and they're doing the, that same type of stuff. Mm -hmm. I, uh, and, um, I watched a thing that was Stephen Ir Irving. Secret the market, remember? 
Steve Irwin. The kid, the son of the Crocodile Hunter, oh, was on gotcha. um, one of the like, late night talk show mm -hmm. with I don't remember which actor his name is, mm -hmm. but he's he's one of those he's a sh really short guy, right. and he's just like. I do not, I do not like animals. Like any animal freak, this guy out. Oh. And nice. they have a bunch of animals, and he's just freaking out and like running around the stage. And I'm like, this is hysterical. Beautiful. Yeah, they like. Uh, What's going on here? He's uh doing a thing. I don't remember. We're we're playing hide and seek with a sibling uh, referral over here, but uh, <laughs> but um. Yeah, I don't remember what the extent of it is, but apparently my cousin's family, like his side of the family, not the one that's connected to my side of the family, is apparently like third or second cousin, third or fourth cousins of uh, that family, the Crocodile Dundee guy. Interesting. Yeah. I got you, Abu. Please give me back that gem. Now, Abu, you have Abu's to like, to fuck honest. that. <laughs> I'm key, this is mine. <laughs> It's not even real. It was just a mirage. Come on, let's go see Princess Jasmine. It's <laughs> not chapter. even real. It was That's a mirage. End of chapter. Yeah, once we return to the palace, probably. <laughs> return to the palace. Returning to the palace. Ah, oh. oh God, I'm running into stuff. I'm trying to find a cat. I mean, it's not my fault. He's literally laying across me at this point. Oh god, I trapped myself. <laughs> Alright, we're good. Let's go. I will not be dishonest again. That I promise. <laughs> See, now he's just lying to us. I commanded that camel to kneel to me. Kneel! My Kneel slave. before your true master. Your true god. Oh no. You're back. Oh. Why do you sound disappointed that we're back? What the heck was You're that? Back. You're back. Oh. Oh no. Which one Whatever. is the real Abu? <gasps> I'm certainly confused. I'll tell you. We'll yes, sure yes, you are confused. <laughs> One of them's a ladder. Oh no, it was actually a goose! I don't know how that would work, but okay. Sure. Magic of illusions. Notice how we haven't run into a single actual villain from any of these movies, by the way. No. Mm -hmm. I'm glad you're okay. back, and I hope you'll stay out of trouble for a while. Thank you for finding him. You're welcome, princess. But the goose was. I feel like Jasmine's voice director did like a really shitty job directing her. <laughs> I want you to sound confused know, here, it's terrible. but the line doesn't seem like it should be. So <laughs> yeah, do it. do it anyways. End of chapter? End of chapter. Yep. That's it. Good timing. Oh, good timing indeed. Yeah. Oh. So, can we just talk about Beauty and the Beast is Stockholm Syndrome? Absolutely. In fact, we'll, and, and probably an episode and a half, we'll be able to really talk about how it's Stockholm Syndrome. Because <laughs> we'll be playing it. <laughs> is it really Stockholm Syndrome, though, if you're super into it? <laughs> yeah, sure. Yeah, alright. Okay, thanks for watching.